Today, we're going to explore the world of confident body language, a secret weapon that can boost your self-assurance and leave a lasting, positive impression on others. Hockey policeman gets to shake hands with the President of the United States. Oh, and here comes the Prime Minister of the... No. <laughs> Body language can play a crucial role in conveying confidence in various situations, such as job interviews, public speaking, negotiations, team management, and so on. Imagine walking into a room and instantly commanding attention, your confidence shining through every movement. That's a skill many people wish to master, and it's not as elusive as you may think. Confidence is a cocktail of posture, presentation, and eye contact, mixed with smooth, deliberate gestures. When you're on a mission, whether it's to shake someone's hand, approach a podium, or simply find your seat, own your purpose and your space. The secret ingredient to confidence. Emulating those who possess it. Model the behaviors of successful leaders or actors, refine your vocabulary, and adjust your gestures to fit the society you're in. An exercise in confidence, say no aloud. Then try it again with a deeper voice and wider fingers. Notice the difference. Be mindful of your speech patterns too. Uptalk, where sentences end like questions, can undermine your authority. Instead, embrace cadence in your speech to engage and hold your audience's attention. Confidence isn't always about puffing out your chest. Sometimes, it's about sitting comfortably in a chair and controlling your environment through deliberate gestures. 25 years old. Don't worry. Any mistake is an income, is a wonderful revenue for you. Convey, don't convince, state your point once with confidence and let it speak for itself. When speaking in public, admit that it's scary, prepare thoroughly, rehearse, and practice relaxation techniques like pressing against a wall. This will help you face your audience with poise and assurance. Here are more tips. Tip 1. Stand tall. Straight posture with your shoulders back and head held high sends a message of strength and confidence. Walk into any room like you own it, and people will take notice. Tip 2. Embrace open gestures. Keep your arms relaxed or use open palm gestures to show openness and approachability. Crossed arms can send a defensive message, so keep it breezy. Tip 3. Take up space. Stand or sit with your feet shoulder width apart, and avoid crossing your limbs. You'll appear more grounded, in control, and confident. Tip 4. Keep fidgeting in check. Relax your hands and resist the urge to touch your face, which can signal nervousness. Channel that energy into exuding confidence instead. Tip 5. Walk with purpose. Keep your head up, shoulders back, and stride with intention. Your confident walk will speak volumes before you even say a word. Tip 6. Maintain a comfortable distance. Respect personal space while still appearing approachable. It's all about striking the right balance. Notice how Modi displays different body language when shaking hands. Tip 7. Use strategic silence. Learn when to pause or remain quiet, allowing others to process information or respond. This demonstrates that you're thoughtful and attentive. To remind America of the fierce urgency of now. This is no time to engage in the luxury of cooling off or to take the tranquilizing drug of gradualism. So, there you have it, all fantastic tips to help you display confidence through body language. But hey, we are not done yet. As your go-to body language expert, I will tell you how to read body language like a pro. Picture this, you're in a room full of people, and you want to know what they're really feeling, without them saying a word. How can you do that? By becoming a body language detective, of course. Let's start with the face, the window to the soul. We're all familiar with smiles and frowns, but did you know that a genuine smile involves not just the mouth, but the eyes too? Look for those little wrinkles at the corners, and you'll know you're onto something real. Raised eyebrows can signal surprise or curiosity, and strong eye contact usually means confidence and interest. But beware. Lack of eye contact could indicate shyness or discomfort. Now, onto gestures. Imagine you're in a conversation, and the other person has their palms open. Good news, they're open and receptive. And watch out for pointing, it could be assertive or aggressive, depending on the situation. Posture speaks volumes too. Standing upright and open. You're looking at confidence and interest. Slouching or hunching, on the other hand, can signal insecurity or fatigue. Leaning in shows engagement and interest, 
while leaning away might mean disinterest or discomfort. Last but not least, don't forget the legs and feet. Crossed legs can mean comfort or self-protection, while tapping feet reveal impatience or nervousness. If someone's feet are pointed towards you, they're likely interested or attracted to you. And there you have it, your quick guide to reading body language like a champ. As you go about your day, keep these body language insights in mind, and you'll start noticing subtle cues that can help you understand people's feelings and intentions. Remember, body language is a powerful tool, and with a little practice, you can become more perceptive, empathetic, and skillful in your interactions with others. Thanks for watching, and make sure to hit that like button and subscribe to our channel for more amazing contents. Until next time.